It's not much what I offer to them. Of course, they eat with the assembly, yeah? But something good that I think they might never have it. They never tasted it because in their country or because being a monk. That's why I tell you, you have to respect them. Respect them. They could stay outside, work, earn a lot of money like you, have husband, wife, kids, have house, car, you know? But the self-denial because they believe in the Buddha. They believe in being a monk, you know? is a way to liberation because they think that the natural of life is ephemeral anyway. I respect that ideal. I respect that they hold on to that belief. Okay? Yeah. That's why we respect them. Hmm? Take a lot of self-denials to do that. So you don't say same, you know, same initiated by Master, it's same. Not same. You enjoy everything. They don't. Do you understand now? Hmm? So give them place and respect, you know, give way when they walk, do anything in your respectful way, okay? Don't think the same, call them brother, sister, same master, same initiate, not the same, they are extra. Apart from keeping five precepts, they keep more precepts than you. Many precepts I don't tell you because you are not nuns and monks, you are not allowed to know it. Because some are delicate, you can't tell in the public, okay? Some are real detail, how to keep the precepts, the real detail. It's not wholesome to tell into the public, okay? And uh, also they deny many things, you know? They don't sleep on a big and high and comfortable bed, not, not all, unless they're sick, eh? And they meditate a lot more, yeah? They truly keep the precepts, they truly understand why they become monks and nuns, why they practice. Some of you don't, because you're too busy outside and distracted by families or jobs or, or earning a living and still attached to that kind of life. Some of you don't. I don't say all of you are attached. Even though you're a lay person, doesn't mean you are not detached. I don't say that, but I say many of you are still not detached from the thing you like to eat, from the clothes you want to wear. Detachment came from inside. And then uh, if you are too much in the world, and it's difficult to detach yourself, difficult to, to have time to think, to concentrate on spiritual practice. That's what I said. I don't mean, in spiritual wise, I don't mean that you cannot become Buddha if you're a lay person or you have less enlightenment. Not necessarily, okay? 